Hey, it's Jeff Manns, Fantasy Alarm TV. Welcome to it, everybody. Another off-season NFL team report. Today, we're breaking down the New York Jets. A tumultuous off-season for the Jets, the men in green. Get rid of Rex Ryan. It's probably a positive move. The foot fetishes and all that stuff. All that nonsense out the door. They bring in new head coach Todd Bowles. Defensive-minded coach from Arizona Cardinals. He's a guy who, you know, very much different than Rex Ryan. He's going to keep a... a Calm atmosphere, professional atmosphere, doesn't like talking to the media, that kind of thing. It's just going to do it on the football field. He brings in Casey Rogers to handle the defensive side of the game and Chan Gailey to run the offense. Chan Gailey is a notable hire here, guys. He's a guy, despite being around the league a long time, he's an innovator. He's a guy who has embraced the spread offense long before a lot of these other dinosaurs did. You know, he runs the pistol type system. It worked well for Ryan Fitzpatrick, it worked well for Tyler Thigpen for crying out loud, and he'll get his shot with Geno Smith and company. And oh, by the way, Ryan Fitzpatrick back in New York. He's with Chan Gailey breathing down the neck of Geno Smith. There's a lot of people that have you buy into Geno Smith and what he's going to do in 2015 based on the last three games last year. I'm going to slow the breaks down. They don't draft Bryce Petty. They don't bring in Ryan Fitzpatrick if they believe in Geno Smith whatsoever. This is not the coaching staff or the, the J, GM that drafted Geno Smith. This is not his team. Geno Smith's going to be on a very short leash, and I'm not going to be drafting him even as a backup in 2015. Other notable signees, they bring back Darrell Rivas and Antonio Cromartie. That's wonderful news for a defensive backfield. This defense is as good as it gets in the NFL, folks. I mean, you're talking about a guy, they drafted Leonard Williams. They, they fell to him, defensive tackle out of USC. In the first round as well. I mean, you're talking about some studs on that offensive line. Revis and Cromartie in the secondary. D. Milner, a guy they drafted first round of 2013 in the defensive backfield as well. This is a talented defensive group with Bowles and Rodgers running the show. Offensively, they're changing things up. They're going to throw the ball more. They're running more shotgun. They traded for Brandon Marshall this offseason. They signed Eric Decker last year. These are good moves. This is a very talented offense now in New York. Just a matter of can they get the right quarterback. In the backfield, Chris Ivory, he does not fit the current scheme. He's a guy, he's a power runner, fit the power run block scheme that Rex Ryan employed the last couple of years. Now they're going zone blocking. What this means, Bilal Powell, believe it or not, Bilal Powell, the best cutback runner currently on the Jets roster, he's the guy that fits the offense the most. He is the guy I would take a shot on in the late rounds as a fantasy football sleeper in 2015. That was the NFL offseason team report for the New York Jets. Check out FantasyAlarm.com for all the latest and greatest. For Fantasy Alarm TV, this has been Jeff Manns.